Hello everyone, happy to see you here on my channel, Hi Mathematics, really interesting mesh challenge today, we have x to the power x equal to 2 to the power 2048. Really interesting challenge, how can we solve this question? Of course, write your suggestion down into the comment section, what do you think is the correct answer? And of course, in one minute we will check our answers, it will be, it will be really interesting. So first of all, if you look closely to our challenge, we have x to the power x, so this is same base and same exponent, this is really important moment, so, so you, for you to see that right here we have same base and same exponent. Right here we have not the same base and not the same exponent, we have completely different values. So it will be really great for us to make from the right hand side the same base and same exponent and then we can easily solve this question. Same base and same exponent right here, same base and same exponent right here and we can easily solve this question in, in two seconds. But before this we should create the same base and same exponent from this right hand side. So let's try to write this question in another way. So not simplify but write this expression in another way that we really need. So we have 2 to the power 2048. Okay, I want to show you a really great trick. So let's write this 2048 as 2 times 1024. Okay, so 2 times 2, 2 to the power 2 times 1000, 1024. Okay, really important moment. And right here, if you know a little bit about rules, so if you have a power rule, we can easily write it as 2 square to the power, in parentheses of course, to the power 1000, 1024. Okay, we can easily write it in this way. This is really important moment because you prefer to solve this from this way to this way, yeah? You don't know how to solve this from this way to this way, but if you look closely, if you spend maybe 10 seconds, I hope you will understand this step. So 2 to the power 2 to the power 1024 is the same as 2 to the power 2 times 1024. So this is absolutely, absolutely the same, okay? So this is equal to 2 to the power 2, this is like 4, yeah? So we have 4 to the power 1000, 1024. And let's do this step once more. So let's write this 1024 as 2, 2, 2 times uh, 512, okay? This is equal to, so we have 4 to the power 2 times 512, okay? Which is equal to, let's do the step once more. So let's bring this 2 inside parentheses. So we have 4 to the power 2 and raised to the power 500 and 512, okay? Right here, 4 squared equal to 16, everyone know about it, so 16 to the power 512. Okay, we don't have like our, our case, we want to, to get the same base and same exponent, we don't have it, so let's do this step once more. So this is equal to 16 to the power, let's divide by 2, so 2 times 256, okay? And right now let's do the same step, let's bring these two inside parentheses, so we have 16 to the power to inside parentheses and we raise all of this by 256, okay? Which is equal to 16 square, everyone know that this is equal to 256 and we have the same base, is the same power, 256. And finally, take a look closely, same base and same exponent and before we had that uh, all the time we have equal sign, so it looks like 2000 to the, 2 to the power 2048 equal to 256 to the power 256. So let's write it. So 2 to the power 2048 equal to 256 to the power 256. So we can easily change this expression by, by this one. And let's do this right now. So uh, let's write right here this. So from here, our x to the power x equal to 256. Yeah, 256 to the power 256. And let's look closely. Same base and same exponent on the left hand side, same base, same exponent on the right hand side, so only one case when this equation will have root is when base equal to base and exponent equal to exponent. We have absolutely the same values on the left and on the right, so from here our x equal to 256. This is our solution. This is quite a great a question to try to solve, to check your uh, power rules, to train your power rules right here, because a lot of really interesting, a lot of really interesting tricks. So let's write our answer. x equal to 256. So I hope your answer is the same as mine, but definitely don't feel bad if you got this wrong. It's really great for you to test your power rules, to, to forget about this solution and to solve it uh, uh, on the paper right right now after this video. And you can easily solve this, you can easily watch this video once more and then you can easily check your, your power rules, is it correct or not correct. This is really great uh, training question, training challenge. Okay, I hope you understand this explanation. I hope you learned something new, but definitely don't feel bad if you got this wrong. If you 
you need help with any of these classes, I have a ton of videos about higher mathematics, about really interesting challenges. And if this video is helpful in any way, don't forget to like and subscribe, and that definitely help me out for this particular video. So thank you for your time, have a great day, and write a question down into the comment section, it will be really interesting to read about it. See you in the next videos, take care!